Whether it's because you're building a custom PC and need to tweak some overclocking settings, or because you need to keep switching between hybrid and discrete mode on your gaming laptop, chances are you'll need to get into your BIOS at some point, and for whatever reason, your keyboard and spamming the delete key doesn't let you do that. So, you have no choice but to boot to Windows and tell Windows that you want to go back to the BIOS. Here's how you do that. First thing you're going to do is click on that start menu and then click on the gear icon for settings. Once there, you're going to click on update and security, then click recovery, and then click restart now under advanced startup. Your computer will shut down, so make sure to save anything you have open. Next, click on troubleshoot, advanced options, and then UEFI firmware settings. This will make the computer shut down and then boot back up automatically to your BIOS settings. Once you're back in your BIOS settings, you can tweak anything you need to, whether it be the system administrator password, overclocking your RAM, changing the boot sequence, you name it. Once done, save and exit, or don't save and exit, and it'll boot back up into Windows. If you're into getting help when it comes to computer stuff, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Leave a comment below what you needed to get back into the BIOS to do, and I'll see you in the next one.